Okay, this is gonna be a quick review of a uh, Traeger pellet sensor. Uh, super easy to install. Uh, comes really nice package. I wanna keep this box. It's super nice. Comes with two screws. I didn't need them. Um, very nice packed. Super easy to install. Of course, a sticker from them. And there you go. You unplug it, remove all the pellets remove the rubber grommet and here's mine basically when you remove the grommet it the plug itself it's 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 in a grommet so um, you don't need to take the front panel at all or uh, just remove this the wire should be attached at least and mine was plug it in your sensor Right there um, of course you're gonna need to remove this just for you to be able to don't remove the screws completely there's two screws uh, just lose them this is gonna come up it has a, sl a slit on the on the bottom so it comes up uh, you install the sensor tie the, uh, the screws back and when you put this one it's not gonna fit exactly because the sensor is in the way but from the back sideways and go on through through the back and then underneath the sensor and um, all good of course this is gonna be empty you can see it's include the light which is super nice and then uh, turn on the smoker it will uh, ask you to before you put the pellets you will ask you to uh, calibrate and uh, super easy super simple um, it's like four or five steps and after that it's good to go and it shows an app um, again not super precise but uh, I watched someone the other video where they shows that possibly you gotta remove this not put it back just because it's messing with whatever the, the way they measure this so right now it's kind of like it shows me 35% obviously it's not so I will not put even 25% so uh, we'll, we'll see I will uh, try to remove this and see if it's possible to calibrate again and maybe it would be more precise alrighty